Almighty God, Father of freedom, author of the blessed spirit, we thank you for the great, the great company of ancient life and musicians, and several generations of instruments. Okay, we now have the pleasure, the honor, and the pleasure of having Noel Bishop with us, who is the first selectman of Westbrook. 
and he would like to have a word. As first selectman of Westbrook, I welcome all of you to this annual muster. We are privileged that you have assembled in our special corner of the world. With our sister town in Deep River, we are the two largest musters in the country. At a time when our American values are being questioned in some parts of the world, events like this reassure all of us that our traditions of democracy are alive and well and will prevail. It is appropriate that our town that was founded in 1635 is host to this annual event. Westbrook has been and will continue to be a community proud of its heritage. A special thanks to Jody McGrath, the Westbrook Drum Corps, and the many volunteers do so much to make this historic event possible. Westbrook salutes all of you in our visiting Fife and Drum Corps. Enjoy the festivities. Thank you. Moran, Alan Cavallo, Bob Atwell, Gus Malstrom, Sal Schiermonti, Freddie Mueller, James Shea, Frederick Wright, Frank Orsini, Betty Moylan, Franz, Roger Franz, and a Mr. Garrity from Stony Creek, Tom Brin, Gerd Summer, James Florence, James Hicks, Mark Chrisman, Paul Lindsay, Randy Stack, Joe Rochette, Bob Powers Boyle, Bill White, and now the roll on. Thank you. Okay. Under the direction of Drum Sergeant Ben Hamill, the Westbrook Drum Corps will play their medley consisting of The Girl I Left Behind Me, The Minstrel Boy, The Rakes of Mallow, and Scotland the Brave.
The most reading will now be presented to Clyde Auger by Bill Hart, who's our pipe instructor and also a very kind and patient man. At this time, the Westbrook Junior Colonials are going to join the seniors on the field so that they can play together Sisters Chick. So come on out, Junior Colonials. At this time, I also want to mention that the 40-plus core is going to be playing after the Colonials exit the field. And if you have been in the pipe and drum community for 40 years or better, you're welcome to join that group in the slot over here, and they're going to come out on the field and play road to Boston. So run, walk, or crawl over to there, and it's your day to shine if you've been with the pipe and drum for 40 years or more. Okay, the Westbrook Crow will now exit the field to Finnegan's Wake. 